New photos from an official visit this morning suggest the stresses and strain of high office are taking their toll on the Prime Minister's follicles. While Rishi Sunak is still only the second shortest serving Prime Minister in the last 60 years, it appears the stress of Britain's most high profile job is hitting him harder than most. On a visit to Cumbria this morning, Mr. Sunak was photographed meeting workers at an engineering firm, touting a new £20 million fund to secure the future of the UK's nuclear industry. While female politicians often bemoan the scrutiny of their appearance, eyebrows have now been raised by the appearance of the Prime Minister. Photos appear to show Mr. Sunak battling rapidly greying hair, with his barnet noticeably lighter and whiter than just a few months ago. Upon being appointed Chancellor of the Exchequer by Boris Johnson in 2020, Mr. Sunak had just a few stray grey hairs. Today his neatly combed thatch is covered with white hairs, while his follicles are much lighter than the black hair he walked into number 11 for the first time with. Mr. Sunak is far from the first number 10 occupant to see the long hours and stress affect the tone of their locks. In 2010, David Cameron was accused of going grey at, a record rate, just three months into the job. Political observers accused the coalition leader of developing grey streaks and a bald spot, contrasting with his thick black hair before winning the election. Five years later, Nigel Farage accused Mr Cameron of dyeing his hair to reverse the ageing process.